Hello everyone, in this video we will see about simple leveling. First let us see what is leveling and why do we use leveling. Let us say you are standing at a point A. You know the mean sea level at point A is 100 meter. So it is known as the benchmark. Benchmark is nothing but a fixed reference of known elevation. So at point A mean sea level is 100 meter. Suppose let us say you are standing there and your friend is standing in a higher ground. You are able to see only his feet at point B. Now you want to know what is the mean sea level of point B. It is also known as reduced level. Reduced level of point B you want to know. That is where simple leveling comes into place. What you do is you keep a leveling staff at point A. Leveling staff is nothing but it is a tall instrument where you have white and black strips like it will have readings here with 5 mm as least count. So you place a leveling staff at point A. You also place another leveling staff at point B. Now you keep an instrument at any point in between. So this is this instrument is nothing but it is called dumpy level it is it is a telescope mounted on a tripod so by standing here you try to sight point a so here you will get some reading let us say the reading is 4 meter then you turn the telescope and you try to sight point b let us say the reading is only 0.1 meter so what happens here? The instrument, let us first find height of instrument. Height of instrument, it is the, this line is known as the line of sight or line of collimation. That is nothing but height of instrument. So what is the height of instrument here? You know the reduced level at point A is 100 meter. So 100 plus 4. So this is 4 meter. So it is 100 plus 4 height of instrument is 104 meter and from here you have turned it and sighted point B. So what is the elevation of point B? It is nothing but 104 minus this part which is 0.1. So you will get the elevation of B. 104 minus 0.1. So it is 103.9 meter. So difference in level between A and B is 3.9 meters, 4 minus 0.1 and as you know the reduced level of A that is below, I mean from the sea level it is 100 meter. So 100 plus 3.9 at B it is 103.9. Now let us see some terms associated with simple leveling. First you are turning back and seeing point A that is known as backside. The formal definition of backside goes like staff reading taken on a point of known reduced level and foresight after you have turned the telescope to find, find out point B. It is staff reading on a point whose reduced level is to be determined. This is back, this is foresight and height of instrument you know and if you keep any staff intermediate to back sight and foresight it is known as intermediate sight. Change point is when you change the instrument point from this point to another point which we will see later. So what are the formulas? It is nothing but elevation of, first let us see, height of instrument equal to reduced level of A plus back side. Elevation of B equal to height of instrument minus foresight. So these are the two formulas which you should know. It is not formula, it is very simple logic. What is the formal definition of simple leveling? It is nothing but to find elevation of points with respect to a given datum. Datum is nothing but the benchmark or the mean sea level at that point. There is one more case when you have an inverted staff. Suppose you want to know the, suppose you have a ceiling here, you want to know the height of the ceiling. So what you do is you hold the staff inverted. You keep the instrument here and you know the reading at this point. 
So here height of instrument let us say this is point A and this is point B. Height of instrument equal to elevation of A plus back side. Now what is the elevation of B? It is nothing but height of instrument plus foresight. It is not minus foresight. When the staff is held inverted it is plus foresight. Now let us solve one problem which came in gate exam. So here they have given that the staff reading taken on a workshop floor using a level is 0.645. So from here some staff reading taken on a workshop floor. So that they are telling it is 0. 645 meter and the inverted staff reading taken to the bottom of a beam suppose let us say the beam is here so the inverted staff reading is 2.960 meter they have also given the reduced level of floor as 40.5 meter so what is the reduced level of bottom of the beam this reduced level so we know the formula for inverted staff level reading first let us find height of instrument height of instrument it is reduced level plus back side reduced level of workshop floor that is 40.5 plus 0.645 meter now reduced level of bottom of beam so that is height of instrument plus foresight in this case so it is 40.5 plus 0.645 minus sorry plus 2.960 if you solve this you will get the answer as 44.105 meter so reduced level in, of bottom of beam is option A that is 44.105 meter there are different methods of leveling this is known as simple leveling which is used uh, this is known as direct leveling where you use the spirit so that is direct relative difference between points you also have trigonometric leveling which is indirectly you find using angles and horizontal distances and also you have barometric leveling where you use the difference in atmospheric pressure in the next video we will see about differential leveling where we will be seeing about two methods that is height of instrument method and rise and fall method Thank you guys for watching the video. To continue to watch more videos, please subscribe to our channel.